Here's a quick tour of 12020 North Carolina Highway 294. It's a house right off of the highway here with a, a pull-off area. Surrounded by other uh, residential homes. Looks like there may be an easement, a driveway that goes to a different parcel that's on the back side. Large overhang here. And there's a small little creek that's running underneath. And you'll see it runs down here and then under the road. There's another Passover and then further down you'll see there's a driveway there's a curb cut back there and a driveway that goes up behind the house. Here's your kitchen. There's a sink. Linoleum floors in poor shape. No fridge. There's stairs. bedroom, large closet, partial full height ceiling, window, another room here, fan, large closet area here, no window in this one. And that's about it, folks. Looks like this may have been used as a... I think it was a ceramic shop. It looks like it may have had ceramics in here. There's an old sign out front. This is the basement level. See, it's got a counter and shelving throughout. As you'll notice everywhere, there are these signs, which make me think it was a ceramic shop. More evidence. So, there is a bathroom down here that's in very poor shape and a utility sink, access to the outside, power. There's some um, HVAC running through here, fluorescent lighting. Exterior door. Down here there's a crawl space of sorts. Hot water heater looks in pretty poor shape. And seems to be a shower of some sort down here. Crawl space. Stairs, very steep stairs. Living room, large window, you'll see this leads out to the side of the house where there's covered awning. I think this is where a mobile home used to sit, which is no longer here, and that's the driveway that goes out. to be the dining room.
very small bedroom, maybe eight, eight by 10, nine by 10, small closet. Second bedroom on the main. It's an exterior entrance, window, small closet. The one full bathroom in the house, tub, everything looks good.